Hello everybody and welcome back to Nuclear Throne. We're back once more and we've made our loop around the characters. We are back to the fishiest of man. And last episode we had some glitchy stuff going on. Uh, this time we start off with the splinter crossbow. A very, very odd merge weapon. I still need to go for a few more of the uh, the loop one and two merge weapons. We have a few, but honestly, nowhere near as many as I should with the amount of time I've been playing this game. Like, really kind of embarrassing how few I have, but... I, the way that I play, the weapons that I use, I, I find looping just very difficult because as soon as there's a lot of enemies, I tend to die because I don't take melee weapons. I know that I probably should, but I don't. I'm going to take that and just go with more rads. I still don't really know how this works. I don't know if it's like good for leveling up or if it's just good for later on once you've already got all your levels and you're using rad-based ammo weapons. I don't actually know what's the, uh, what's the better play here. Okay, we desperately need another gun. Otherwise, we ain't getting any of these reds. In fact, we might die because there is just a lot going on right now. I'm hoping... Oh my god, what have I done? Like, this this weapon's great for this, in a way. But in a lot of other ways, it's not great at all for this. Because, as you can see, I'm having a really, really hard time. Oh, we're dead, we're dead. Yeah. I'm going to say, I basically had to run in to try and get that gun, and it didn't work. I think it was a good play to try it, because if we hadn't, we'd just have missed out on all the rads anyway, so what the hell was the point? Um, but, a little bit upsetting that I missed out on quite so many rads. See, that's what we need, a shotgun. I really don't like it when you get a melee weapon on the first stage, because although that situation there would have been good for a melee weapon, screwdriver ain't going to do it. Again, remember, Think Tank is insanely powerful if we get it early on, it's a must take. It's very, very, very good, and it's just very fun. It allows us to get more rads, more health, more ammo, more um, better weapon qualities. It's just all around really, really good. Uh, let's use this for a bit. Yeah, all in all, just very, very, very good in my opinion. Good. Um, yes, I'll take the slugger. I'll take the slugger. It's not much different than the weapon we've got going on right now, which is not good, but... Come on now. No, my scorpion. <laughs> my buddy. Okay, I think because we already fire splinters, um, we don't have bolts. We, go, we want to go for that instead. Bolts ricochet. Even though both say bolts, but only one actually works. I still think that's the better one to take. But this should be pretty good. We should notice a lot easier killings. In fact, I'm going to take the waxers too, because then these should bounce as well. Yeah, they do. Nice. Good stuff. Okay, don't die. That would be dumb. It means a lot of bandits firing at me right now. Uh, oh my god, there's a lot of scorpions firing at me too, apparently. If you could chill out, guys, that'd be great. Thank you. But yeah, now we've got a melee weapon that's actually going to do some, some good for us. It should be like a five shot, I think. Maybe six shot. No, five shot. Nice. Okay, good setup so far. I like it, I like it. Um, I actually think the scarier face is a great one to take here. Having these little bolts be able to bounce around and kill more things is going to be very, very good. Uh, boom. As many of those in there as we can. Good, good. Oh, we've managed to fucking set that guy alight, but luckily he didn't last long. He didn't last long. My god, yeah, this is good. I like this. Not having to aim so much. Very good for me. Okay, of course I should have shot that. I realise that now. I realise the error of my ways. That's a push piston. That's not what I wanted. This is what I wanted. A blaster. Open that up real quick. And I think we're just going to go through. I really like this with a bouncy as well. It's really good. Well, this is a good set of meats so far. A very good set of meats indeed. I like it a lot. Nope. Oh, I didn't want to go through here. We're going through now, I guess. I, I, I wasn't really intending to do this. This is not conducive to, um, to the meats that I wanted, but... The setup that I wanted, should I say, not the meats that I wanted. Good. Stop crawling out of that. It's very annoying. Yeah, this is one-shotting a lot of the more annoying enemies, which is 
giving me a lot less of a worry than I had prior. Get the poison throwers out of here, because they're very annoying. Uh, luckily, we can get rid of poison pretty easily via that. Oh, for God's sake, dude. Can you, like, stop managing to dodge everything that I do? The assault crossbow. Oh, yeah, I'll take an assault crossbow. We're going to die. I just feel it. No, we've done it. We've managed to do it somehow. Cool guy, could you help me? Ayo. Not bad at all. Still don't really know how to do the silver tongue smuggled goods business. We're going to go for strong spirit here. Clam shield is always a good one. Wow, that was brutal game. That was absolutely brutal. Immediately walking into that trap. I don't like this. Give me that health. Yes. Oh, what the hell? There's fire here as well. For fuck's sake, this game's brutal. No! Stop trying to make me die, you shit. I'm, I'm so fucked here. There's just too much fire. Like, I just don't know what I'm going to do. I don't think there's a single safe spot that I can go to here. Like, I just don't know. That's not even it. That's not even it. What the fuck am I meant to do, game? Hello, assassin. If you could make your way, form an orderly queue and get the fuck over here now, I'd be very happy. Okay, I did manage to hit him somehow. Now there's a crow down there as well that I need to get over here too. Oh, God. This is fun. I'm going to die if I try and move here, aren't I? I just know it. Fuck it, I don't care. Fuck this game sometimes. No, no, sorry, no. No, no, no. Fuck that particular bullshit piece of crap sometimes. I, ah, I can't believe that's still in the game. I'm sorry, modders, but it's just ass. <laughs> it's just not fun at all. Maybe I'm being a, a bit OTT, but I feel like some generations of that flaw, it's just impossible to not die. If it generates in such a way, which it did that time, you just can't get past it. It's just, it's basically not possible. And then... The crow manages to sit on the other side of the map, so you, you can't do anything. It's really fun. It's just really fun is what it is. That's what we'll say. That's what we'll keep telling ourselves. It's just really fun. Really? Well, Maggot, you had to survive, did you? So that is that really cool run where we had a lot of good stuff. Just gone to a random bit of fire. Honestly, that's really good, but the soda supply drop thing is so insanely powerful. We get ourselves infinite ammo for a little bit. Unfortunate, but hey her. Um, Hasten, get in there. Got a bunch of te temporary things, additional pet slot. That's good. Try and take care of the majority of the level first. I'll leave you alive. No, I won't. I lied. Need to go. Let's leave this one maggot alive. I don't even know what I'm getting. I'm just taking them all. Yeah, we got frog milk. Frog milk's one of the best ones, definitely. Got you as well. Good, good. 
Accuracy up and all that jazz. Think tank again. We got to take it early. It's super good. Sadly, we don't have the bouncy bounces this time, so... Not quite a sheet. Oh, God. We, we must have got a lot of accuracy ups, because this is kind of insane. Yeah, please stop. Okay, I need to kill you immediately. Okay, well, it doesn't matter, actually. We probably can't kill you immediately. We're out of ammo. Are you kidding me? Just leave me alone for a minute. I've got no ammo. Good, good, you're dead. You both of you are one shot. Nice. Got you as well. Oh my god, this game sometimes. It's a scary one. It's a scary one. Thought that was an alive one then, it was not. Good, good. Okay, I think we managed to get all of the uh, burns we needed there as well. Um, definitely go for scary affairs here. Okay, we don't need any of these burns, actually. We'll take the harpoon launcher, though. Actually, nah, we'll stick with the wrench. It's a bit safer. There you go. With scary affairs, we can easily kill these guys. And I like that a lot. Why did I even break that? Now I'm not going to be able to get those rads. That was really dumb. I just kind of saw it and instinctively was like, smack. No, we... Oh, we missed them all. Yeah, good. That was dumb. You see someone through a wall and you're just like, hey, I can hit that from here. Does it give me any bonus or usage? No. Do it anyways, brain. My brain's like, go, 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 go. Smack it, smack it. Why, brain, why? I don't need to smack it. Um... Weak enemies drop special pickups. Yes, I think special pickups can be pretty good. We'll take that. Good, good. Got you as well. This weapon's so strong for a starting weapon. It's great. I love it. Thank you for the extra infinite ammo. Not that the infinite ammo is worth anything, really, but thank you nonetheless. Just another portal. Bouncer SMG, why not? Bouncer SMG can be pretty great. We've also got accuracy up and stuff as well, so not as inaccurate as it normally is. Would like some healing, though. Very much like some healing. More ammo. I don't want the ammo. Just it just gives you Oh no. Assassin saw him. I saw him. I don't I don't really get like I don't know if any if any uh, territorial expansion devs still watch the series at all. Um I'm gonna guess not at this point. But anyways, if if any of them do, for one, heed my words about the fucking stupid fire traps. But for two, I don't really get the point in the extra ammo pickup, the special pickup. It doesn't really do anything. It used to be great. It used to like allow you to stack ammo, like reserve ammo, which admittedly was a little overpowered, but why not just make it have like a limit to how high you can stack it? Because at the minute you get like 0.1 second of infinite ammo and it's almost always completely useless. Like, I get that on some of the late game guns that use like 40 ammo a shot, it could be seen as a little bit better. But even then, it's still pretty bad. Especially if you don't have that perk, that means you get it more often. But even with that perk, it's still pretty bad. Be nice to see that redone or reworked or something. But I'm pretty sure Nuclear Throne Territorial Expansion has had its final update now, so probably not going to happen. But we got to get the supply drop again. Got to go for it. It's too good. I just love the way they block shots as well. They, like, they, they actively make the stage a little easier. Hey, sir. Really? So allow me to drink my sodas and be on my way, please. Okay. 
Take you out. One, two, three, four, five. Nice one. Is that stage over? It is. Okay, let's be careful. We don't want to leave yet. Right, we got all the all the machines. So we go drink. That's reload speed. Infinite ammo. Uh, additional pet slot. Immunity. Infinite ammo. Max speed up. Uh, hastened. More frog milk. Ammo gain up. Hastened to get in there. God damn it, I keep getting hastened. I don't really need hastened right now. Lots of frog milk as well. Lots of poison immunity. That one wasn't so good. We got some good stuff in there. We also got some not so good stuff. Chests give infinite ammo. I feel like that's very good. We should go for that. Oh no, I left my weapon behind. I mean, we got a crossbow still, so it's fine. You. Luckily, you didn't fire, so you didn't end up setting that guy off. Boom. Okay, we're doing fine. We are doing just fine. And what we get there? Toxic launcher? Nah, thank you. Actually, no. Do you know what? We're toxic immune now. I actually think the toxic launcher could be pretty good. Boom and boom. Like, being toxic immune is a pretty big bonus. Something you don't normally get to play around with too much. Boom. You've been toxic. Just you know that I'm toxic. Boom. 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 Just laying Toxic down kind of everywhere. It's kind of fun. Something unique. Something's weird about it. Just doesn't feel right. Boom. And do you wanna get do you wanna get deaded? Yes you do. Oh, I think we got the gaslighter. Isn't the gaslighter like really, really good for toxic? Yeah, if we charge it all the way up, we can do that one. Yep, this is actually really good for us right now. I know that we can do that if we want to uh, blast it all. Yeah, this is actually a perfect weapon for right now. And it charges up really quickly as well. Boom. Crack that open. Damn it, didn't get my chests. Would have liked them. Um... Gamma Guts. We'll go with the, the, the piercing one. That's pretty good. See if we actually have the thing that he wants yet. Do we have what you want? I'll help you find it, but... but should we are we taking Chaos Mutes at this point? I don't think we are. I'm going to stick with normal. Synergy. You're damn right, Synergy. You're damn right, Synergy. I love that. This 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 weapon with toxic immunity. It's pretty great. Also, can you get down off of there finally? No. No. He's chilling. He does not want to get down. Right, get a few of them in there. And there you go. Get all that ammo real quick. The plasmite cannon. My goodness. That guy finally, he finally got down. He did eventually decide to get off his ass. Auto crossbow, very good. Um... I'm going to go with Strong Spirit again here. I want to keep this run alive. This run's great. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Do you know I said I wanted to keep this run alive? Please don't kill me instantly.
Okay, probably not the best to actually use the Gaslighter like that. Prism is also an interesting one. Bouncer Shotgun. Does Pris doesn't Prism do like... Yeah. Prism's pretty good. Hmm. I think I think the autocross goes better though. Nice. Is that it? No, apparently not. Y'all left, okay. Is that a super crossbow there? I'll take a super crossbow. What the hell just hit me? Okay, we managed to get some health back there. Okay, I managed to get most of that going. Good, good. I love this. And then we just go, boom, fire. Be great if I had that uh, rad that makes uh, toxic home. That'd be so good with this. Uh, ooh, thick skull. I'm trying to think what thick skull would do well with over any of these. Extra max ammo, possibly. Let's try it. We didn't, we didn't get either of those. We can either have more infinite ammo, another supply drop. I'm going to go with another supply drop and try that out. Please tell me it works. If it doesn't work, I'm going to be really upset. It looks like it didn't work. I'm not going to lie. It just looks like it straight up didn't work. I ain't seeing any soda cans anywhere. Which is a big sad. Should have just taken scarier face. Unless they're just all up here. Get a few of them down there. Okay, we're in. Yep, yeah, unfortunately that didn't work at all, which is just very, very sad. I kind of forgot we'd already been here, I'm not going to lie. I, I can't believe how overpowered these things are. How am I meant to survive this bullshit? Like that. That's a good way of doing it. <laughs> One-shotting him with a super crossbow. That's the, that's, that's the way. Damn. Get a few of those in there. Right, just just absolutely laying waste to the land with these. Oh shit, I got caught then, that was close. So I don't even think the super crossbow is very good against this guy, so. kind of the best way of doing it. I think, at least. <laughs> I don't actually know. I'm just kind of making it up as I go along. Okay, we got him. We got him. It did work. Eventually, it did work. Took a bit of time, but eventually it worked. Quickly check the weapons chest. The scout rifle. Mm, intriguing. Still think this is better. It's at least more fun. This is a build that you don't get to do very often. Right, later boys. Especially these weaker enemies, it's very fun. Absolutely filling the place with poison. It's just so weird, it's so like... Uncommon. <laughs> the big iron. Isn't the big iron really, really, really good? Uh, we definitely want that. Okay, how much is it doing to these guys? Okay, so gas is kind of falling off a little bit. 
I'd definitely say it's falling off a little bit, yeah. Luckily, this thing's kind of nuts. We'll see if we can take something else this stage. The Vector Cannon. Yeah, we'll try the Vector Cannon. We need to switch over anyways. Gaslight is fun, but it's just not doing the damage we need it to anymore. Is that the sex double minigun? It is, isn't it? <laughs> Imagine that with an accuracy of... I don't think we can take it. It uses a bit too much ammo for my liking. Definitely going to take Herming here, I think. Although we are very low on ammo. Okay, on our way we go. Um, I think this is the best of all of them there, to be honest. Light ring cannon. Okay, this is the good one. This is the good one. Yeah, the light ring cannon's very, very good. It's annoying you have to shoot to get this guy to wake up. Anyways, this should absolutely destroy these, um, these generators here. I should think. I should think. Three shots, yeah. Three, two, three. One, two, three. One, two. Okay, that one was two shots. Uh, excuse me? Can I explain myself there, game? He went a bit crazy there. He went a little bit mad. Right. Just go for it. Okay, we got him. We got him. Oh my god. Spicy. Spicy. Help. Oh. Okay, this is kind of nuts. And also, the infinite ammo is actually going to help here because we're getting a lot of weaker enemies. No thank you, Squire. No thank you, Squire. Oh, I like this. Right. Enemies sometimes drop chests. Chests give us infinite ammo, so that's pretty good. Infinite ammo for the first seven seconds. Faster reload while reloading. Reaching max ammo. Reaching max ammo uses ammo to give you more max ammo. What? I'm just going to take this first one. I think this could be pretty uh, pretty insane. Okay, we're in here. Didn't mean to go in here, but we're in here now. What is happening? You are you are correct to ask that question. Okay, we could so easily die here, though. That's kind of the annoying thing. I think we got them all? We did. We got them all. Okay, lost all the health there. Get back a little bit. We got a lot of it back, don't worry. It gives us a considerable length of time of infinite ammo. What the hell gun was that? 
The Nuke Pop Launcher. Ultra Crossbow. What's the difference with the Ultra Crossbow exactly? I don't really get what the big deal with this thing is. I'm gonna keep this just in case. Oh shit, mother just lobbed toxic at me. But don't worry, because I'm immune to toxic. Don't be stupid. I said that and immediately remembered. Get one of those out. Get another one of those out, apparently. And another one of those out. Dude, this fucking stupid bitch keeps hitting me. Okay. That was a bit spicy. Mega Laser Prism. Oh my good golly gosh. Big shotgun. I'm just kind of checking everywhere I can right now. Holy hell, duty calls. Gimme, gimme. Extra ammo. Well, I say extra ammo. It's not actually extra ammo. It's infinite ammo. For a short amount of time. I don't really get what stacking multiple of you even does as well. Energy screwdriver. I don't think that's really going to cut it, is it? There's a police dude down here somewhere. There he is. Sadly, we can't get to him yet. Very annoying. Love this enemy so much. think it's perfectly designed. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Don't know where the uh, portal is, but hey, her. There it is. The light ring launcher isn't really getting much use at the minute. I need to swap it out for something better. It's just, it doesn't really work in small spaces is the problem. Okay, we need to be very careful right now because we are very low on HP. There's a good, good old chest there for us. We've got the flame schlammer. MT schlammer. Fuck this enemy in the ass. Nice. Max ammo again. Is that everything? I think that's everything. Good, good. This is sexy. I like it. I like it. Honestly, this is just having these bounce all over all over the place is kind of great. Okay, our infinite ammo was lasting a really long time, and I'm not quite sure why. Maybe that's just a new part of it. I don't know about. You stack multiple of them, this just lasts a lot longer. Okay, that killed him very quickly. Walk right into that one. Ultra pop gun. Right, everything is dead now. I think it's all dead now. Kinda wanna bring that with me. See, I just wanna see what it's like. Ultra pop gun. Seems like it could be fun. Seems pretty good to me. Seems pretty good to me. What on earth? What's, what's going on with the stage? Where's the rest of it? Oh, it's here. Hyper Crystal, here she is. 
to ruin our lives. Golden plasma gun? We've already got a good golden weapon on this. Die, beast. That's a lot of policies. Nice. This is great. I'm loving this. Something special. The blood blood can bullet bullet orb cannon. Nah. U Ultra pop gun's kind of better, I think. Everything's better at the minute. We do need something better than the Ultra pop gun. It's good, but. We need like something that's gonna save face and just like wipe an entire screen of enemies instantly. Good, good, good. What are you guys doing down here? You are you hanging around? No, thank you. God damn, we are cleaning screens right now. Of course there's another one of these guys. Fuck you. Hate you. You're the worst. Need health pretty badly right now. There you go, there's some health. I want that chest opened. Give me that infinite ammo, give me that ammo back and everything as well. Oh my god, calm down. Calm down. And there's a health crate as well, awesome. Right. We do have to still be quite careful about how we maneuver what we're doing but otherwise things are going well this this could be the end of us this boss there's just a lot of other stuff going on that we're having a really hard time dealing with during this boss fight so okay this thing's gained more legs as well i'm noticing on loop this thing gains legs okay there you go thank god that guy dropped the health for it that was almost as dead but yeah doesn't that make him easier to kill though I thought him having more legs would make him easier to kill. Maybe I'm wrong. I guess that I'm wrong. Otherwise, why would they do it? But surely him having more legs means it's easier to hit him. Maybe that's just because he gains more HP on loop because he wanted to make him easier to kill. Honestly, I haven't, I'm not an expert. I have no idea. God damn it. I shot at the worst time then. But that was a very fun episode. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. And I'll see you guys in the next one.